Hey, welcome back to Farming Simulator 17. I got, uh, I think this is going to be episode 3 of uh, Old, Tr Old Streams map. Uh, if you remember the last episode, we were taking some wool over, but the trigger wasn't working. So I went ahead and fixed the trigger. Uh, I still left it the same way that we had it. We brought it out. And I went and made a little bit of addition here to our farm. I have my diesel. It's all warmed up already. So let's uh, head over to drop this wool. So here's uh, one of the addition. I put some fence here on the outside of the farm. I uh, put the building over here. And I loaded this truck to the max. Look at how beautiful it looks. Now this trailer, that's going to be my next project. I'm going to go ahead and make it a little bit wider. Uh, because as you can see the front truck fits three uh, pallets in one row. And this one only fits two. And then the other thing, I added some wraps here. So uh, it'll be uh, to make it easier. So when I load so let's go over to the um, to the wool area. Let's go drop this wool off. And then I also put a gate out here in front for more privacy. Now I figured out what the uh, vehicles that were stuck in that uh, little um, the little warehouse where we dropped the wool off uh, it was the traffic so as soon as I saved it exited the game and then came back in uh, those vehicles were gone so I have the same number of sheep I put everything back the same way it was because I had to uh, restart a new game Now I did find uh, all the gold coins. I've never actually uh, done that before. Oh, actually, the gold nuggets. So this was my first time uh, finding all 100 of them, and I'm not gonna spoil it for you. So go ahead and give it a try, and there's a nice big surprise at the end. It did take me a while to find those uh, 100 gold coins. Okay, so we're back here. Uh, like the first time, we're gonna back up. We actually came in a different way. Let me see if I can. I'll be able to back in good. Before I start unloading, let me show you what I did. If you remember our uh, the last episode, so it was here. So now I have a little um, what is this? A little front loader, or what are these called? Yeah, it's a little front loader in case I want to uh, unload it manually. So I left this as it was. I just moved the trigger over a little bit so here's to sell the, uh, the eggs and uh, I removed the door here because it did have a trigger but it wasn't in the game so I just took it off uh, I'll use this for storage uh, and here's the, uh, the inside we were working on that day so here's that trigger remember I moved it out I moved the trigger out and I made it a little longer so as soon as I start backing in here, it should start unloading. I haven't tested it out, so this is going to be the first time. So hopefully it uh, it unloads. So there we go. We start seeing the money go up, so it is unloading. So 
so we're gonna go ahead and back up all the way and let's look how or where our trigger is so it just fits perfectly so I my frames did drop a little bit but look at that that trigger is just perfectly so now let me uh, unstrap them that one there's that one okay so there it is guys uh, I hope you like what I did I hope you uh, watch the last video of that tutorial on how to uh, move the, the triggers and how to edit them I uh, hope you like it so give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't and I'll see you next time